What's up guys, Dylan here from Boing Vert. Make sure you like and subscribe to get the best information on vertical jumping anywhere in the world. You know, when I was younger, I was talking to a track coach. It was a long time ago, but I remember that he said to me, the reason most white men can't jump very high, those are his words, he was a black guy. He said it has nothing to do with anything other than the fact that they have flat asses. I burst out laughing, but he was dead serious. He pointed at some guys on his track team, and I noticed that they had bigger glutes than some of the slower athletes. It was pretty obvious. Now, I remember the track coach telling me that when I read this article a while ago. The article is entitled, The Effects of Gluteal Muscles Specific Exercise Program on Vertical Jump. It's by a bunch of authors from Spain. What they found is really fascinating, and it plays a huge part in our new eight-week program coming very soon called Boing Vert Beast. Now, Boing Vert Beast is going to be the most advanced, the most effective, the most thorough program ever made. It will really be revolutionary. I'll do a walkthrough of it very, very soon. But it's really based on a lot of studies and a lot of science. So I said it plays a huge part in our program, and I want to tell you why. Let's look at the abstract of this paper. They write, the vertical jump is a complex movement where many factors are involved in the final result. Currently, how a specific exercise program for gluteal muscles can affect the vertical jump is unknown. Now, that's partially true, but we at Boing Vert knew this for a long time. We've always put major focus on the rear of your body. We've spoken about it often in our programs, but this study adds even more credence to it. And furthermore, it actually helped us tweak our program to make it even more effective. Reading on, the authors write, So, the aim of this study was to examine the effect of a specific exercise program for gluteal muscles on a vertical jump. 49 amateur athletes completed an eight-week program. The experimental group received a specific gluteal muscle training program in addition to their regular training routine whereas the control group received their regular training routine. I want to stop right here and point out, okay, so both groups were doing vertical jump programs, right? They were both doing an eight-week vertical jump program. But one group was doing the eight-week vertical jump program plus a gluteal-specific program. That is, targeting their backside in, spe in a specific additional program. Okay, so what did they find? Jump height, flight time, that's like hang time, speed and power were assessed. They set a baseline, so they did it before the experiment began. They then tested it right after a post-intervention. They tested it right after the program was completed, and then they did a four-week follow-up. So the measurements at eight weeks, that's that post-intervention measurement, revealed significant increases in the experimental group compared to the control group for the values jump height. Listen to this. The experimental group improved 18% compared to the control group at 3%. That's insane. Flight time in the experimental group, they increased 8%, the control group only 4%. Speed, experimental group 2%, control group 1.83%, about the same. And power, experimental group 4.43%, and the control group 0.32%. Those are staggering differences major differences. I actually got in an argument with somebody else who made a jump program. This was a long time ago, maybe eight years ago. And they told me, oh, you don't have to focus on the glutes or the hams. You know, it's just uh, really need the quads and the calves. And I was losing it. I said, you know, it's funny because when I have been around like really high jumpers, if you look at their calves and their quads, they're really well defined, but the calves can be very small, but you always notice. And I think I was kind of remembering the conversation I had with that track coach, you always notice that their glutes and their hamstrings are super, super strong, super strong. So this is a fascinating finding, and it confirms what that track coach originally told me. In Boing Vert Beast, we have our own program that you do within the program. We have Boing Buttocks, if you will. <laughs> no, but we really do have something like that, that is part of Boing Vert Beast, which again, will be launching soon. I'll do a walkthrough uh, on this channel. Now, I think it's important to note most people's gluteal muscles are very weak. They're very weak. And you can really start to improve your vert right now by training them. The authors wrote, the gluteus maximus is prone to weakness and inhibition due to prolonged sitting. 
and this could negatively affect sports performances. In addition, a decrease in the activity of the gluteus maximus would increase the reliance on the secondary hip extensor muscles, that's hamstrings, changing the motor pattern in order to keep the function and potentially leading to pain and strain injuries. So by working your glutes, you're going to increase your vert and you're potentially preventing injury. I don't want to leave you with just that. So I want to give you some great glute exercises you can start doing now. You should do these every other day and about 30 seconds rest between sets. And you can use body weight or dumbbells if you have them. The first exercise is a Bulgarian split squat. Here's a video of it. You can perform three sets by 10. The next exercise is weighted glute bridge, same three by 10. And the final exercise is a goblet squat. And again, you can do three by 10. One more point before going, the paper also states that after four weeks, they retested the athletes who went through the program and the changes did not last, did not last. So you need to continue to perform glute exercises after you complete a jump program. It's very important and you need to keep working out. That's why in Boingvert Beast, we have a maintenance program that incorporates gluteal training so you can maintain your gains just by working out once or twice a week. All right, guys, this is Dylan from Boingvert. Please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, go to boingvert.com to get our programs and be on the lookout for Boingvert Beast.